The International Day of Yoga means that the entire world is looking at yoga as a solution for all aspects of their life to a point where even United Nations is looking at how to manifest the millennial goals using yoga as a tool. When this is the case, it's very important, we in India must be very proud that this science of inner well-being, this science of raising a human to the highest possible state that one can be in, this science originates in our culture. The great sages of the past, above all Adi Yogi, who is the source of this science, have continued this process as a live process for thousands of years. For this many millennia they carried this. This is for us to make it ours. There are more people practicing yoga in other parts of the world than in India, that paints me. This yoga day, all of you must take this up, that in your life, at least a simple form of yoga, you must take it up. We are offering online three minutes yoga, six minutes yoga, fifteen minutes yoga, whatever you want. Whatever you are ready for, bring a simple dimension of yoga into your life and just see the change and the transformation that it brings about in your health, in your mental state, in your emotional balance and above all, in the spiritual dimensions opening up how they open up. It is my wish and my blessing. Every one of you should benefit from this. Every citizen in this country must know the benefit of yoga because this is our pride. It is with this that we built a great civilization. Well, we have gone down in the last few generations, maybe in the last few hundreds. India has suffered in many ways, but it is time once again to put this nation back in the place where it deserves. With this many people and a huge intellect and talent that we have, with the right amount of yoga, if you bring the necessary inner strength and balance, I know that your energies, your capabilities and your skills will make you into a great human being and in turn make Bharat into a great nation.